What is going on, everybody? My name is Jacob Forster, and welcome to Boxes Lost Fragments. If you could tell by the style of this game, this game very much uh, kind of emulating the Room series of games, which is a wonderful puzzle game series I played through here on my channel. Um, and the developers of this game, they reached out and were like, hey, would you like a code? And I said, absolutely, yes, I would. And so, very cool to be able to play this today for uh, the release. This isn't sponsored, but uh, I did want to obviously make sure you all know that I was given this for free. So let's check this out. I love these kind of puzzle games. I do also have... Well, I'm like trying to see what's going on here. Oh. Elliot Clockworks. Oh, okay. Interesting. Tutorial. Click on the box to focus on it. I do have... There's another series of games that are similar to this. Uh, the Da Vinci uh, something. I forget what it's called exactly. But I own those too. I have all three of those games. I still need to play those at some point. Um, but I wanted to check this out. I think you could probably beat this in like two to four hours, depending how quickly you get through it. So this might be a two-parter. Um, click on the box to focus it. Slide the latch to unlock. Got it. Let's open this up. Click on the item to collect it. Folded key, very cool. Click the collected item to inspect it. Okay. Let's uh, go ahead and move it around. I can open it. Ooh, cool. Object found, mechanical key. Click the letter to... This is what I love about these games. I love the intricacy of not only the puzzles, but like each little item that's in the game and in the within the environment. I just love the way that everything works. I require your services in order to obtain something very important. It should be an easy task for a person of your skill, and there is a sizable reward involved. Should you succeed, the key I am sending with this letter will help you with the final step of this assignment. Good luck, Aurora. I did check out this developer as well. Apparently they did another game that was kind of in the same uh, puzzle box uh, genre, a little bit more um, fantasy, fantastical in style. This one's much more in kind of the rooms style. Right click to zoom out. Got it. Click and drag the screen to look around. Cool. All right, I got it. I got it. I know how to play these games, man. Okay, so obviously we got to rotate this somehow. Yeah, there it is. Got it. Got it. I'm assuming only one can go at a time. Oh, interesting. Very... Oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm already doing terribly at this puzzle. Wait, what is... Wait a second. Wait one second. What do you want from me? Oh, that one will go through. No problem. And then this one... We'll go like that. There we go. <laughs> This is what's this is what's here to come. <laughs> Drag the key into the keyhole. Got it. Cool. Assuming, yeah, oh yeah. Very tactile noises. Very good. Got this cool mask. Is this gonna help us see puzzles or something? <gasps> my thief hand with my awesome glove. <laughs> cool. Oh, oh, we are a thief. We've stolen the mask and they've locked us in. Okay. Cool, cool. I guess what are we having to do from here? Is it a breakout? Explore on your own. <laughs> Tutorial. Do it yourself. <laughs> All right. Cool. Very cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm so excited for this. You can really just kind of look around wherever you want. So what's up with this thing? May as well check it out. Initium Nexus... Cognito, Fractus, and Aurora. Interesting. So we need uh, some kind of mechanism, something to slot in here, I'm assuming. Doesn't look like we can interact with much else. Also, what is this? Ah, okay. So that's just the options. I'm assuming that's for a hint, which... <laughs> we don't need any of those down here! <laughs> we don't need no hints in this gameplay. <laughs> If you've seen my room series, uh, you know I was definitely one to 
just absolutely power through any and all puzzles <laughs> without taking a single hint because I'm I'm insane. I'm I'm clinically insane. Fragment collected. Token. Ooh. 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 Thank you. I'll find a place to use a token. I know exactly where I'm going to use this token. It's the exact shape that I need. I like this uh, little gem with the mask in it. Looks like you can set something there, which is interesting. Let's keep looking around. I can only look left and right in here. Let's take a look at the clock. Hmm. Interesting. Open this up. And we've got the weights. Get the clock moving. Cool. Okay, so I doubt I put it in here. No. So what else do I do? I guess I'll have to find something for that. And then let's check out Mr. Knight here. Is this a <laughs> roulette table? This looks like a roulette table. I think it is. <laughs> oh! Whoa! <laughs> okay. Now what? Do I, oh, do I put this here? No. Huh. Okay. <laughs> I, I have opened you, but I do not know why. All right, let's take our little, uh, little, little crest or emblem, the token, that's what it's called. Slot it in here, see what happens. Okay, beginnings, use the first token. <gasps> Very cool. Oh, 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 okay. So are these the different, so like this is an overall level and then there's four levels from there? I guess that's what it feels like. Let's jump on in. Cool. Very cool. All right. First little puzzle box. Very intricate. Very unique. Okay, what's up with this little box, first of all? What can I do with you? Almost looks like there's little latches, little buttons here. Can't go all the way around it to interact with it. I'm very curious how in like in depth these puzzles will be compared to the room because the room you really really gotta like make sure you're checking every tiny little detail to make sure you're getting the right things going. Okay, so this is showing just a part of the globe that maybe I would need to stop it on. Huh. Okay, so it seems like I need to stop this at some point, but we don't have the ability to do so. Here we go. Ah. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Flippy to switchy. Let's go. Get you going. Oh, oh. And a little key. Object found. Okay, anything unique with you that I can mess around with? It looks like this... The tip <laughs> could potentially flippy floppy. Not too sure though. I'm guessing that you go into here, the big padlock. Yeah, cool, cool. And what are you? <gasps> a mechanical disc. It looks like it's a little out of sorts here. Is that correct? Oh, you can move that too? <laughs> oh. Um. <laughs> Got it. Oh, yeah, yeah there's a, a more pointy part there. Mechanical disc. Very good. All right. Nice. So that looks like some type of a gear. <laughs> Obviously. For maybe this to stop it. And what do we have up here? Ooh. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, oh, you could drop something in there, maybe? That's what it seems like. Okay, so... Oh, what do I do with... Oh! Whoa! Oh, cool! Okay, so it seems like we need to... Maybe make a clear path? Like an opening of some kind? I don't exactly know what I'm doing here. <laughs> it's almost clock s esque, clockish. Hmm. 
I still need to figure out what to do with... It's like, there's this thing down here. Did I just slot this right here? No. Can I interact with you anymore? Because this is like a compass, like north. Like, that's the north uh, little line. I don't have much else to go off of. I don't see anything that's gear-wise would fit into this. Oh! Oh! This little guy! I forgot about this little guy! <laughs> there we go! Ha <laughs> ha! Ooh! Ah, cool! I almost, I almost forgot about you! Little metal sphere. I'm assuming we drop you into the thingy. Maybe that will help to open it up. So let's get back up here. Toss the sphere in. Oh! oh! It's your eyeball. Okay, let's go ahead and get you down into here. Ah, cool, cool. Spooky. All right, now that we have the lights going, I can figure out what to do with the circles. So, oh my gosh, there's a lot of circles. Um, so these three need to be like this. Oh, that was perfect. We literally did it perfectly on the other one. <gasps> Tiny door. Whoa! Whoa! Ooh, that's cool. Okay, got different star signs? Is that what that is? Oh, okay, so I need to... Ah, I see. Okay, so I need to move them to be in the proper position. So, um, horseshoe line at the top, uh, saddle at the bottom, W Jesus on the right, and 69 on the left. <laughs> Let's figure that out. Um, 69 on the left. <laughs> w Jesus on the right. Um, this one is at the top. This one is here, and then this one's here. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh! Ooh! This is so cool! Let's go. What do you got for me? Oh. Oh. Oh! Okay. Nice. What is this? <gasps> strange compass. Oh, okay. I like a, I like strange anything, you know? I like I like the oddities. We like the, the little little tingies. These are all great. These are all good. Like this little statue holding it. I love, I always love this effect. It's always so fun. All right, cool. Let's go ahead and uh, move back over to here. I'm assuming now this is lit up. We can toss you here. Yeah. <gasps> there we go. Awesome. So now it's going to let us. It's telling me to go south. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay. Oh, that was it. Okay, cool. <laughs> Fragment collected. A bear sigil figure. Awesome. We love ourselves a good bear sigil figure. Sweet. Okay, so it just opens up for the next one. Um, what do I do with this, though? What do I do with the bear figure? Bear sigil figure. Okay, I'm assuming I'm supposed to just go in there, but what if I come back over here? No? What about over here? No? <laughs> what about over here? <laughs> oh! It worked. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Open up your mechanical chest, sir. What do we get? Bank vault is opening. Oh, oh, oh! Who's this mysterious man? This mysterious fellow. He's got the uh, token as a pendant. This isn't giving me much, though, unfortunately. <laughs> so I guess I'll just leave then. So long, sir. I'm going into the next level. See you later. Ooh, I like this little box. 
This one looks cool. So what do we have down here? Noom. <laughs> New <laughs> From the Earth to the Moon. Oh my gosh! <laughs> A book of images. W.T. Horton and W.B. Yeats. Yo! Uh, the Story of the Sun, Sir Robert S. Ball, M-A-L-L-D-R-S, whoosh! <laughs> what is this? A book? <laughs> surprise, surprise! Oh, so easy. Oh, can, can I open you? Are you gonna, are you gonna open? <laughs> oh, I gotta flip that over. <laughs> Ooh, that's a fun little picture. The Designer, November 1899. Small handle. We love a small handle here. Got a round back. Got it. This nice glowy blue gem that's present on a lot of things around here, which I greatly appreciate. Can I push in here and wind it up? Oh. oh. So we can change the time. How precise can we be? Very precise. Okay. Interesting. So we'll have to figure that out. Uh, anything at the... Up, the tippity top. Oh, oh, another small handle. Sweet. Uh, thank you, sir. And, oh, what is this down here? Another small handle? Oh, oh. Oh, dang. Okay, so we need another mechanism for that somehow, some way. I don't see anything I can interact with here, so let's go to this one. So I can pull this down. Ha ha ha. Uh, this goes in here. <gasps> and this goes in here. Ha ha ha. Oh, that, that was perfect. <laughs> Metal disc. Awesome. Okay, so that's, that is gonna go over here then, right? Same circular pattern. No? Interesting. Oh, this is easy. Boom! <laughs> mechanical wheel. Cool. So, can the mechanical... No, not you. Not you! Can the mechanical wheel go here? <gasps> yeah! There we go. Now we got a handle. Oh! See you later! Fine. That's fine. I didn't want to continue hanging out with you. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, these rotate. Oh, interesting. Ah, let's open these doors up. And it looks like I can do something here or here. Yeah. <gasps> sweet. Oh, sweet. Oh, and that's what this one is for. Cool. What's happening? Oh, nothing. It's just zooming me back out. All right, now we put you in the little star-shaped thingy and open this up. Okay, not quite. We just keep going. Yeah. <laughs> Look at this little guy. <laughs> Look at this. He's got his little bumblebee shirt and he's got his red hat. He's got a great little facial hair, his mustache and beard can i oh oh yes please please oh it's a small key i was gonna oh i wanted to wind you up buddy and do some cool stuff you know all right what's, what's up with this oh Ew, does that now go over here and put this in the clock thingy yeah okay Oh, my gosh. What is even happening? Um. Oh. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm building a clock, I think. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> this is a fun little uh, mini game type of thing we got going on. Wham! I gotta let it go all the way around just for... Wham! That missed? Are you kidding? <laughs> How about... No! Cool! 
cool, I guess. <laughs> Ooh. What is this? What are you? <gasps> Dimensions look through the Oculus. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, this is cool. Oh, there's the little hat man, and he's showing us the little star sign. Okay, little star sign guys got the, the, the 96. <laughs> On this side, it's got the, um, the pitchfork. That's how I'll remember that, I guess. This side, uh, I couldn't tell ya. Is it on one of these rotating things? I don't know. Um, this side, oh, that's right, you could zoom in some, I guess. Oh, can you maybe see it through the clock? No. I'm honestly not too sure what I'm supposed to be doing with this Oculus. Hello! <laughs> Such a cool little guy. What a cool little guy. Okay, so maybe we just need to set the clock then to 547? So let's see if I can do that. Is that, is that close? Yeah, it's, it's right in the middle of that, it's right in the middle of that. It's like 547, right? Is that not accurate? <laughs> Excuse me, little man. What do you want from me? Can you lift your hat up? Oh wait, if I change things in this world, would that change anything? I don't know. Oh yeah, because I'm actually looking at, if you can see like on the, the bottom section, you can see where I'm looking at this in the real area. Because um, depending on where I move this, then we'll be on that section with the oculus pointing there. Which is strange. So how do I get this to do its thing then? Because I can't interact with you anymore. I can't interact with you. I can only interact with the clock. Oh, and yeah, you, you can't do it exactly like with each individual little stroke. It has to be just either on the number or in between. Oh, 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 oh. I didn't even see this over here. Oh, I didn't even see that over there either. Oh, okay, hold on. <laughs> I was wondering what I was saying. Okay, pitchfork and 69. <laughs> Right? <laughs> yeah, where are they at? Pitchfork. And the old 96. <laughs> cool. What is that? It's not Gemini, is it? I don't know what this one I don't know any of the star signs. <laughs> Fragment collected. Ornate hourglass. Ooh, okay. Alright. Little hornet hourglass? It's pretty cool. I would love one of these little these little trinkets, some of these little little fun things that you get to pick up in real life. They're always so cool, so so in depth. Just fun to look at, you know? Okay, I'm going back over here because I feel like something needs to go back onto this button. Not at all. <laughs> now, is there anything else I can do with you? Not that I know of. Come over here. <gasps> Look at that! We could put Mr. B, Mr. Hornet in here! Fun. Spling! 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 <laughs> the wall gonna change? It is! <gasps> Look at that! Who is this? We got Mr. Owl. I did it! <laughs> Too good at this. <laughs> okay, so we don't know any of the function of this quite yet. We'll come back to it. I'm assuming we go through all four doors, get all of these unique pieces, and it will allow us to go through. Also, this is wait, is this still just the first level, I'm assuming? Because there's no way I'm I'm about to finish the third level here. We'll keep going, we'll keep going. 
really enjoying this, if you couldn't tell. Ooh, a little marble box. I like this one. So let's open this first. Okay, we need a little key. This is a fun looking box. Um, let's just start with this, er, I guess, oh. Oh, has a kind of a honeycomb shape. Let's see, can I mess with any of this? Ooh, ooh, there we go. Ah, okay. So we need a little uh, key there, a little hexagonal key. So we got this. Assuming these need to be straightened out. Yeah. Oh. Ooh, I like those, uh, I like the color kind of pattern that's going on here. Don't know if I have anything to do with it though. So let's go over here. Bells? Oh. Thought it was gonna go shling, shling. <laughs> Ah, oh, they're little handles. Cool. That's a fun looking key. Now, does this one fit into here? It does! Yeah! Yeah! An ornate sphere! Okay, can I open you up? No, no, you go down. You go down, because that one's down there. <gasps> I see. Okay. Oh, yeah. I'm not making a fool out of myself this time playing these games. <laughs> A tool? Oh, it's the hexagonal tool! There were so many points when I was playing through the room series where I was like, I don't know what to do! <laughs> and it got pretty, uh, pretty difficult at times. Ah, color coding. Okay, so blue, so BGRY, so BGRY. B, G, R and Y. I know that's orange, but it just helped my brain to do it like that. <gasps> the crest! Small shield. You're going to go right on top. I won't inspect it, though, because the back side is not the same shape as this. Interesting. Should have still fit, though. Ooh! Ah! <laughs> too easy! <laughs> too much, too big brained. Too big brained. Oh no. <laughs> small brained. <laughs> Immediate small brained. Alright, um. Is there something else I was supposed to solve right here? <laughs> I think that's it. What am I supposed to do up there? Do these move? No. Seems like I can't actually interact with anything here at the moment. Looks as though I need to find something that has six prongs that will fit in the top. But from where would I gather such a e equipment? Um, obviously nothing in here. I don't know how to interact with anything else here. Uh, those are just the doors that opened up. So this was just a key that helped us uh, to get through an earlier section. Can't interact with that down there. And this little guy is a no-go as well. Wait a second. What about you? Because we moved this. No. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Okay, no interaction with that. And then this side I can't even click on, interestingly enough. So, what would you have me do? Because we put the crest in and then it just flippy flopped, you know? Which is not what I was expecting. Man, I was just boasting about how big my brain was and now we're just <laughs> absolutely stuck. <laughs> It's okay, it's a, it's a quick, quick stick. Should be able to get through this. No problem. No problem at all. Hello? I heard that. <laughs> I think everybody heard that. Who's out here? 
Oh, that's fun. It's fun looking in the background. I haven't really been paying attention too much because the, the foreground is so exciting and so much going on here. Um, is there something on the table on the edges here that I've sorely missed? So it doesn't seem like this game has had us go into like strange locations yet. Oh my gosh, strange locations! Strange locations! <laughs> Okay, yep, the game's doing this to us. A hundred percent, it's doing it to us. Okay, and that's the sixth prong that I was looking for. Got it, got it, got it. So let's toss you up here. Love this. Absolutely love this. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, this is... <gasps> Oh, no way! This is so cool! Doing a little platforming here. <laughs> oh, this is so cool! Go, little ladybug, go! <laughs> oh, this is fun. Okay, what happens when you touch that? Oh! Oh! Ah, got it, got it, got it. Uh-oh. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> I just came out of nowhere. What does this one do? Ah! Oh! Oh, 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 okay. Oh! Whoa! Whoa, cool. I don't know if, I don't, I don't know if I meant to do anything with that down there, or if that made the stairs. I'm not too sure. Oh, now we flip it back over. Oh, it all makes sense now. Oh, cool. Oh, I see, I understand. Let's go, Ladybug. <laughs> all right, what are you doing now? <gasps> Where are you going? Oh, now we get the little uh, thingy. The owl. That's what we needed. The owl figure. Let's go. Love it. Love it. Owl figure. Acquired. Okay. Well, you know what I have to do. I have to go back over here and put the little owl figure in the owl figure slot. Ah. Um. Oh. Oh. I see. I see. Ah, very cool. <gasps> Wait, do I do it? Do I do it? Do I pull the lever? Pull the lever. <laughs> okay. Hmm. And what is this? Sweet. Developer, if you ever want me to, um, personally do all the sound effects for this game with just my voice, please let me know. <laughs> okay, this is a pretty sick looking laser. Um, I'm assuming we can get something that will be able to control the laser and point it straight at his little uh, little emblem on his necklace. But either way, let's jump into the next little Puzel. <laughs> yes, the Puzel. <laughs> Ooh, ooh. Can I just unscrew this by hand, please? No. I like the water surrounding this one. <gasps> plunger? Pull the plunger? <gasps> oh, it's an anchor! <laughs> cool. So what do I do with this? Surely this is like a screwdriver or something. Um, do I pull these up? <gasps> I do. Ah, a clam? A clam shell? I gotta open it. I gotta open it. Let me in! <laughs> Let me in! You can see his little clam tongue. <laughs> cool. <gasps> Mr. Octopus. <gasps> a little metal figure. Okay. Nice. What's on your back there, though? 
Let me in. Um, so he's got a screw. Interesting. So let's see how I can put these together with this, maybe? Yeah, 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 yeah. And screw it. It is a screwdriver, 100%. Oh, no, we've lost her. Her little thingy. <gasps> Tiny boat. Tiny boat for me? Little model ship. Love it. Oh. Ha. Oh, model ship with stand. Oh, even better. <laughs> cool. And then I know what we do here. A little clamshell goes right here. <gasps> it opens up and we get a beautiful little marble. <laughs> no, a pearl. Of course, it's a pearl. It's even shiny, too. Ew, it kind of looks like an eyeball. Is it supposed to be an eyeball? I don't know. Either way. Uh, do you go here? Do you go here? Is the marble or the pearl go here? The pearl goes there. Got it. Okay. Um. Oh. Oh? I don't... Um... Oh, okay. I just had to f f just kind of guess which ones they went to. Because that makes sense. Is this a new note? What is this? It is! Okay. <clears throat> As I tirelessly tested various materials, a particular composite of rare metals exhibited unexplainable patterns of, oh, and energy flows. Seems to be drawing from an infinite energy source. There's only one hypothetical form of energy that is believed to permeate all of space, yet it is invisible. It represents chaos that couldn't be attached to anything material. Dark energy. I have to study this phenomenon further. It holds the promise of reaching uncharted territories. Okay. Interesting. Alright, so what's going on over here? Oh, I feel like I've done this puzzle before! <laughs> Have I done this puzzle before? It feels like I've done this before. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be easy. Go right there, and then whoop! Yeah! Nice! Oh, bigger model ship. We got baby ship and big boy ship. Cool. Um, oh, there's sides. Got it. Do I put you in here? Yeah. Oh, it's a flint. Oh, it's a flint. That's what it is. <laughs> oh, it's gonna shoot the glass. Let's see, let's see. <laughs> Why is this so loud? <laughs> that was unusual, unusually loud. <laughs> it's great though, that's great. All right, cool. Um, let's see. Uh -huh. Oh, can I open the door? How do I get inside? Please let me in. Um, go to this side. This side. Okay, it just doesn't let you. Interesting. Um, I don't have any more items, so obviously I need the, the old steering wheel. <laughs> um, where's the steering wheel though? The ship opens up in half, like it folds open like this. You can see kind of where the, the pieces are. So is there something I can interact with with the overall piece? Maybe I can make... <clears throat> no. Hmm. Interesting. 
Very interesting. You can look at the clam again, but that doesn't really give us anything. Ah, uh, the top still has, no, still has nothing. Can I get the seahorse back? Or anything in here? No. Okay. I'm just imagining you all hearing me just go clickety clickety click 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 click. <laughs> a lot of clicking going on here, just kind of checking around, seeing what I can find. Um, oh my gosh! Oh, let's go inside. <clears throat> Ooh, we doing a little game here? How does this work? Oh. Huh? <laughs> um. Crap. Ah, uh, I get it. I need to trap. I need to trap them. I need to fully trap them, right? Is that the deal? So if I do one here, it goes away. Get the closest one. And then the next closest one. And then here. And then here. Ah. I think I got it. We're trapping them slowly but surely. Okay. Oh, this is where it's gonna get tricky, though. Uh oh. We got it. We got it. Oh no! No! <laughs> okay. 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 Um. Okay. I'm assuming maybe I need to start on like one of these pieces. Maybe like one of these pieces. Interesting choice. <clears throat> Oh gosh. I'm ruined. <laughs> He's escaped. <laughs> huh. Um, let's try here first. And then here. And then here. There we go. Okay, this might get us going. I mean, this will confuse you too much. And then we go here. Got it. Um... I think this is going exactly how I need it to. Ooh, do I keep doing it across this way? Because I might trap myself if I do something else. Then, oh, okay, okay, so if I click here, he goes here. Then I click here, and he goes here. So that should be perfect, because if I click here, he's gonna go here, and then here, he's gonna go here, and then here, he has to go all the way around, <coughs> which might make this actually better. Um, so here to here, here to here, and then I would click here, and then he'd go here, and then I'd click here, and he'd go here, and then I'd click here, and then he'd go to here. So let's just do it down here. Because I don't think it matters either way. Oh, oh no! <laughs> Gosh dang it! <laughs> oh, I'm so stupid! <laughs> oh, dang it. Ah, oh, dang it. Okay, it's fine. We know the general formula. Oh, dang it! Uh. <laughs> All right, this will trap them for sure. There we go. <laughs> Ooh, the ship's helm. Cool. It's exactly what I needed. Thank you. I like the little uh, interior here. It's pretty cool. Now we can go over here, put this on. We can start steering this bad boy. The prism! Oh yeah, and that'll let us go ahead and move the laser a bit. So we can do kind of some fun stuff with that. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Very exciting. Very exciting stuff here. Look at that prism. So prismy. <laughs> Alright, let's throw that prism on the board. Wham! Plum! <gasps> Uh, hidden gems reveal the token. Ah, look at that. New fragment, a new token. Ooh. So cool, so cool. Awesome. Uh, so this will go to our next level then, won't it? 
Aha! Sweet! Off to the Nexus. So this will open up more doors, I'm assuming? <gasps> we just go higher. Oh, okay. Oh, this is great. Away we go! Chapter one complete. Initium. All right, sweet. Oh, that's great. Yeah, let's do one more chapter. Let's do another chapter. <coughs> Excuse me. Sweet. Oh, gosh. All right, we're already opening up a door for ourselves. And we've got four floors, it looks like. So four more doors. Four more doors to get through. What's over here? What is this? What are you? Mm, sure, we'll figure it out later. <laughs> what is this? What are you? Okay. What are you? Ooh, I got nothing. Ooh, what are you? <laughs> Ooh, what is this? Big door. Ooh. Bethesda? Ooh, what is this? I, I gotta touch everything. <laughs> oh, those light bulbs are different colors. <laughs> okay. All right, let's just go in. Let's go in the room. Let's go in the room. Waited long enough. <laughs> Messing around a bit too much. Ooh, this looks like a little ap uh, apothecary box. Oh, it definitely is. Can I open you? Please, <laughs> let me in. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Oh, nice. <clears throat> wow, that's complex. Uh, oh, oh, oh. So I gotta do it until all the yellow pieces are out? Or all the yellow pieces are in? <sighs> there it is. Yeah. Yeah. <gasps> Special lens? Ooh, I see nothing. <laughs> so I gotta put a little slide over here, it would seem. So I gotta probably make something. Ooh, goggles! <gasps> gimme, gimme, gimme! Glasses. Oh! What? I just did. <laughs> An optical lens. Perfect. And a screwdriver. Such a. Standard piece of operating equipment for this for this puzzles. No need to solve them. Just unscrew everything. Nice. Oh, the power glove. Let's go. Screwdriver. Obviously. Get that out of here. Did I actually unscrew it? Oh, okay. It does it automatically. <gasps> broken mechanism. Nice. I mean, that doesn't look too broken to me. I think we can fix this. No problem. <laughs> we just gotta get the little thingy over to the thingy and then, then it's all cool. So I'm assuming we need to fix the mechanism, which will allow the glove to operate. It'll release its grasp and we can take this strange light bulb thingy. I uh, can't interact with anything else right there. <clears throat> oh, I got no more screwdriver, by the way. So, it's not a slide. We're actually powering this bad boy. And then go over here, and we can put the lens on top. Ha ha ha. Oh, cool. It's a zoom. So, how does this one work? Oh, it's shooting lasers, isn't it? Um... Oh, no. It's one of these kinds of puzzles. <laughs> uh, yeah, so that needs to hook into that side, right? That's what I'm assuming. Uh, okay, goes there, goes there, goes there. Uh, and then you can just go all the way over there. Got it. And then you can go there, and then you can go here. 
Something's working. Um, I'd like to get this one out of the way, though. So, let's see if I can... Basically, at this point, what we need to do is we need to move stuff as far away from this general area as possible to make room for all this other stuff to just kind of get out of here. So hopefully this will function the way I'm hoping it will. So basically, we're just moving everything up and out of here and away. And then that should perfectly get us exactly where we need to go by moving this here, here, up to here, this over here, down, and then back over. Cool. Now we got the fix mechanism. Go back over to the hand. Toss this bad boy in. And... Release the gripper! <laughs> um, release. Please. And thank you. Uh, I have no screwdriver. I have no items. Um, what would you like me to do? These little guys are blinking. Is there a button somewhere? To get this thing working? Come on now! I know we can do it. We can we can work on this together. As long as we just try. We try our best. We try our best. <laughs> um, <clears throat> what am I missing here? Am I supposed to be able to get in here? Somehow, some way? Again, I have no items. Don't let me through. This is done. Don't need to do anything else with this. There's nothing even to zoom in on. Um. <laughs> People gotta stop dropping things out in the <laughs> off in the background. <laughs> oh, I see you. Okay, that's what I was looking for. I'm looking for something that's just a little bit off. <gasps> ah. Get these out of here! Get them out of here! <laughs> Flip that switch! Let's go! <clears throat> oh! Ooh! Ooh, this is fun. Okay. Um. Oh. Oh. Oh! Whoa! 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 <laughs> Whoa! We got pressure. We got power. It's glove time, baby! Okay, what's going on over here? <gasps> I gotta plug it in! <laughs> there we go. <laughs> let's go! <laughs> oh, sis! <laughs> let's go, dude! <laughs> oh, that one looks like it, it hurts to do. Uh <laughs> oh, snow! How rude! <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is good. Okay, we gotta do Shaka and then the flip them off. <laughs> Fragment collected. Electric key. Sick. <laughs> that was great. That was really great. Up a level, please. Floor number two. Very cool. Okay. So I don't need to uh, solve this all at the end of each little section. I can do all four sections and then solve the rooms puzzle. Alright, off to a great start with this one. Sweep, sweep. Oh, a little battery socket. Okay, positive and negative. Thanks for telling us which way to go. Looks like these could flip up somehow. But no dice. No dice. Got this strange thing here with the PlayStation controller uh, buttons, <laughs> which are these. <gasps> the crystal globe. Surely I can just open you up and take you here. Intricate mechanism. Okay. I'm assuming we cannot slot this here right now with those little rings going by. So let's move on to some other things like this. <gasps> Keyhole. What a keyhole. <laughs> I don't have a key for that. Button. Oh. Oh. 
<gasps> and another note. Love notes. Did I miss a note on the very first level? They're in the laboratories, charged with anticipation as I delve deeper into the quest to harness dark energy as a revolutionary power source. Placing the rare metal composite within a copper alloy container seems to act as a conduit, channeling the elusive forces that permeate the cosmos into a tangible and controllable power source. The implications are staggering. This could lead to a more precise and efficient extraction process. Mm, indeed it could. What is this? Sweep? <gasps> My battery! Look at that little stumpy boy. <laughs> I love that little battery. Cool guy. Okay, what's up with this? Ah! Oh! Whoa! Tool! We got a tool up in here. Alright, cool. We got a tool. Very nice. What is this? Oh! Oh! <gasps> tool? No. Okay. Don't have the right piece for that. We just got this big old circle thingy. Okay, well, let's put the battery in, first of all. Shweep! Make sure it's the right way. Okay, good. Whoa! It's the infinity stones, baby. <laughs> ah! You can do the old flippy floppers here. Let's get that over. Flippity flop, and then floppity flip. Oh, I need red to get all the way over. Like so. And then flippy flop these. Steady. Nice. Whoa, 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 this is so cool! It's even unlocked. Flip the table lights. Oh, I'll flip them. I'll flippy those floppies. Ah, oh, it's a connection. And a metal lever. Mmm, mmm. I assume you are gonna go into here, maybe. Yeah. Uh-huh. Ah. ah, that opens it up. Okay. So now we gotta move these so that they are in line, like so. And then button. Yeah. Ah. Ah, and then you're my tool. The strange tool that opens this. Cool. The right side and the left side. Perfect. Yes, hello. Oh, there's more behind it. Aha, little key. Now, where do I need to bring? Oh, that's right, the keyhole for the key. Got him. Ooh, mechanism part. Now, where does that go? Do I, ah. Can I move this? No, okay. Goes into the round hole. Love it. So I'm assuming this can turn. No, only this. Oh, grody. Um, so it needs to be this one, this one, and this one. So the most I can do is a double flip to try to get these solved. But that doesn't feel like it makes any sense. Because this is not going to, oh, 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 you can do that. Oh, this makes more sense. <laughs> okay, so we need to make it so that the cog here to the left of it is this piece. And then this piece. So flip that real quick. Move this. That goes there. Flip that. And then flip you. So now we just need to do, I think, a full couple of rotations. And then it should be perfect. Yeah. Love that. Love that. This reminds me of a chocolate orange. Ooh. Ooh, fragment collector, the mechanical sphere. Ah, I like the way that looks. A little light bulbs on it. With the little curly coils and everything. So fun. This is so great. I'm really enjoying this. I gotta play more of these games. Um, 
The House of Da Vinci. That's what the other uh, series is called that I own. I own all three of them. Just have not yet played or recorded them. Meant to do it uh, before the holidays, before the end of the year <laughs> last year. I just never got around to it, unfortunately. Okay. So we got a little, little nub over here. Uh, this looks like a little train. I pull this down. It is a little train. Can I grab you? <gasps> Ornament piece. Stab you right in the eye. <laughs> Okay. It's almost a fleur de lis. Let's see. Uh, I see. You're missing a piece here. Oh, just a mechanical item. Oh. Got this little. Oh. Oh. Oh, cool. And it's a gear now. That's fun. That's very fun. Let's open this side. Oh. So, a valve, okay, interesting. So obviously I need to slot something onto here. It's not gonna be that. Um, and then pull the lever and the piston will go and we'll start firing off on the tangy. That looks like it's the perfect fit for here though. Nice, and then we can rotate it, so move those and come up to here. I need to move it so that there is a good spacing, double spacing. Easy enough. I'm just going to find the right location. Ooh! Ah! <laughs> oh, that's fun. That's fun. All right, let's take this wrench. And it looks like I can place the valve right here. Yes, we can. Yes, we can. Ah, and that connects the tube. Got it. So that's where our steam is going to come through. I'm assuming I need to set this at a very specific range. Let's do a... Uh, let me go to 50! <laughs> it won't let me go to 50. I was going to do 50s across the board, but it won't let me! It won't let me! How rude! <laughs> All right, let's, um, was this open before? No, I don't think it was. Either way, let's uh, open this up. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Okay, um, I don't have anything for that yet. Can I take that weird hexagonal piece I had from earlier? I feel like I should have been able to take that for something. I guess not. Oh! Hexagonal. Wrench. Duh! <laughs> I'm a dummy! There we go. Okay. Um. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be a nightmare! <laughs> Oh, crap. Crap. Is it gonna be a nightmare? <laughs> Maybe. Let's go! Let's go! Okay, it's way too high. Um, bottom right, top right, top left. Bottom right, top right, top left. Bottom right, top right, top left. And here goes the piston. Full steam ahead, Captain! This is so good. I love this. Okay, now what? <gasps> oh. So we're gonna grab something? <laughs> ah! <laughs> cool! Okay, 
I don't know when it's coming, I'm just... <laughs> going off of instinct here. <laughs> My super instincts! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> cool. Sweet. My hands The new piece. Ah, fragment collector, the mechanical console. Let's go. Let's go. Very exciting. All right, in the final uh, floor for this chapter. Floor number four for chapter two. Sick. Let's get in here. Let's do it. <laughs> All right, uh, where is this going to take us then? Why did I do that? Why was that so loud? <laughs> uh, sorry. <laughs> Oopsie. All right, we need to figure out um this way. Work backwards. It's the easiest way to do it. Not. Oh, that was. Oh, I was like, oh, not quite on that one. That was literally perfect. <laughs> Wa, 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 wa. Okay, this one's done, apparently. Don't know what that means. <gasps> I got you over here. Clickety-clack. Clickety-click. <laughs> Sick. Still don't know what I'm doing, but I'm doing it. <laughs> Okay, I need a little fuse for there. Oh. Oh, okay, I need a light bulb as well. Got it. What do we have down here? Oh, I got a new note! <gasps> Let's go. Soon, in a di- in I- <laughs> Let me start over. <laughs> Soon, in an idea that seemed audacious began to take a root. Building a sophisticated containment gem chamber. <laughs> I'm really struggling today. A kind of eternal dark energy heart, harnessing all the mysteries of the universe. This dark energy heart could provide my creation with unprecedented power, allowing it to execute complex tasks and calculations at speeds previously deemed impossible. Her name will be iPhone 14. <laughs> It'll be Aurora. Okay, so what do we got here? One, two, three. I don't, I don't know what I'm doing here. Um, oh, it's up here. Uh, little thingy. Oh, I got my light bulb. Let's go. Light bulb time, baby. Here you go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Full power. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, the whole thing rotates. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, how many times can I do? Okay, got it. Oh, 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 okay, okay, there's more than just that one. Makes it a little bit easier. Makes it a lot easier. Uh, oh, no, not you. Um, well, shoot. Let's put you there, and I put you there, and then I can come back here and put you here, and then I can flip you all the way around, and put you here, and then I can come back and put you here. Okay, so that's one side completely done ski. Um, looks like the LR is gonna be the next logical choice. This is going to be a tad bit tricky, but I think I can put you here. Yep. Um, move you here. And then I need to get that. Oh, and yeah. Oh, oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put you here. And then take the LR out. Move you here. Next logical choice is this one. Obviously, I need to get that LR out of there, um, which I can just do very quickly by doing that, and then doing that, and then putting you right back into here. <clears throat> That's the one that I need, um, which has the smaller piece. Oh, it's, it's in the exact same spot. Got it. So let's put you here, 
and then we'll put you here. So then I can do this little guy here, do the old flippity floppity, and put you here. Nice. And then I want the plus minus, which I have the small piece of the plus minus right here. Um, so I'll put you here, put you here, here. Uh, dang it. Um, it could have been an easier way to do that, but that's fine. Uh, that's good. Move you out there and then move you. Uh, darn. Okay. Yep. <laughs> I was like, I could do something fun with it. Try to get it a little bit faster, but nah. It didn't want me to do that. Okay, so those are all prepped and ready to go now, uh, which means I can do one of these, move you there, put you there and there, and then finally rotate it back and then put you guys in here. Nice. Very good. Ooh! Ooh! So satisfying. So satisfying. That's a big glowy orb. Can I touch? I want to do a touch, please. Um, oh! That's not what I was trying to do. There's something over here. A fuse. Ah, the fuse! And there's something over here, too. Ah, an electric plug! Oh, I see a little switchy on you. Electric but It's a converter! It goes from a three-prong to a two-prong! That's not very safe! Where's the ground? Okay, fuse. Fuse! Right down here. That's right. I almost forgot about you. But I didn't forget about you. Because I remembered you. <laughs> fun. Ooh, that's fun. Okay, and then the fuse. The fuse! Do I put the fuse or uh, the, the plug? Yeah, wait, how do I deal with this? I still never figured this out, did I? I guess we'll wait a second. Wait just a darn second. Oh, three, four, two, three, three, four, two, three. Got it. Three, four, two, three. Oh, it all makes sense now. Then we can uh, plug it in. Cool. Sick. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, I guess. That's really cool. <laughs> the next fragment, the power source. Awesome. Oh, this is great. I'm loving this. All right, I've got all the pieces. So now we can solve the rooms puzzle. Oh, so exciting, so exciting. Okay, uh, where do we start? Where do we start? Let's start over here at the little switchy, switchy. <laughs> Pull the lever. Oh, okay. I gotta set it all up. <laughs> uh, the light bulb! The light bulb goes in here! Nice! Ooh! Maybe I should have done this <laughs> earlier, uh, one piece at a time, because I don't know the order in which I'm supposed to do this. I'm assuming I was supposed to do the bulb first. Which, that wasn't right either. Oh! Oh, what the heck? Um, <laughs> is that not what you want from me? <laughs> oh wait, these, are these ones not lit up? <gasps> oh, I see, I see, uh, this has to be Blue, red. These aren't the colors. Blue, blue, red. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Um, so I need to switch just these two. 
which seems easy enough if I can. Oh no. Is that it? Did I do it? Yeah, yeah, there we go. Cool. Very cool. Alright. This thing's moving over. Got it. Oh, that goes way up here. Whoa. Whoa. That's cool. That's cool. Alright, the big vault door here. This is where this little orby goes. Yeah. Opening up the vault, going out in the wasteland, baby. Got it. Bulb cog, fan plug. Bulb cog, fan plug. Bulb cog, fan plug. Nice, now we can pull the lever. All four are ready. All right, it's time, it's time. What is it gonna do? Ooh. <gasps> Sarcophagus, reveal the containment device. What's inside? <gasps> the next token! <laughs> so cool. So cool. Also, it looks like there's little thingies down there, though, that I can interact with. I would love to pull these thingies. <laughs> also, what's inside? It looks like nothing. <laughs> cool! <laughs> Alright, that was the Nexus. Now we're moving on to Cognito. This is great. This is great. I'm really enjoying this. I am very much enjoying this. Chapter 2 complete. The Nexus. <gasps> and with that, I'm going to go back to the main menu. Because I do want to save this, Chapter 3, Cognito, uh, for another playthrough. I want to uh, I want to pace myself with this. I know sometimes these puzzle games can <laughs> they can fatigue you uh, rather quickly, especially if you've been playing for a little while and then you're just like, oh, I gotta I gotta keep doing the puzzles. Depending on how quickly I get past chapter three and four, I guess we'll see if I do five in the same video um, or if I save that for a whole uh, video itself. I'm doing the final section because uh, I, I was I checked I usually try to check with these games like how many chapters are there so there's chapters one through five and then there's like an ending sequence it seems so it looks like I can do two per uh, video potentially unless these next two chapters are pretty quick then I'll just finish it all out in one other video which will likely be tomorrow <laughs> but this is great I would love 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 to hear your thoughts on this um, I, does it have an, its own unique kind of style enough to separate itself from the the, the room series of games? I think so. I, I think they've got, again, they, they share a lot of similarities in their style, but this one's kind of going for its own kind of unique thing, um, especially in the, the puzzle design themselves are really, really great. And yeah, me personally, I just really like it. Um, but I'd love to hear what you all think. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button. Comment down below. Love to hear any, like I said, thoughts and feelings from you all. If you're not already subscribed, make sure you do so. That way you know exactly when I'm uploading the next parts of this or just any other videos that I'm uploading or when I'm going live for uh, my little Stardew Mondays. Uh, and of course, hit that bell notification as well. Did I already say that? I may have already said that. <laughs> but that way you know exactly when. Um, <laughs> if you want to see any of my other socials, anything else that I do, don't forget to follow me on any of those deals. They're always listed in the description down below as uh, individual links. And uh, yeah, with all that being said, you all are awesome. You all 
are amazing. And I cannot wait to see you all in the next video. Later.